This is Mystic. This is Mystic. Yes. Let's get right up in it. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. We come to you in the energy of knowing. We would like to know what are the energies of today? What is really the deal? How do they really feel? That's what we want to know. How do they really feel, Holy Spirit? So, we start this thing off with how you going to try to be wife material? How you going to try to live that wife life when you a project chick? A hood rat chick? That's what I want to know. You know what I'm saying? I want to know. You know what I'm saying? Where the home skills come in at? Where the, where the, the job skills come in? Where the employment skills come in at? You pay $62 for rent. How you going to manage being somebody's wife? How you going to manage getting food when you get food stamps? You ain't paying your money with no real live money. I'm trying to figure out. I had the real life, real life. That's the energy for the day. Because you know what? I had the real life sit there and say, what is the energies of the day? The energy says these karmic chicks is out here faking, living that trife like they, like they want to be wives and all that. You don't even have the apparatus. You don't even know what it's like to be somebody's wife. For real, hood chick. So let's just know why why do they feel like they got an entitlement? I would like to know. Okay, so we they empresses in reverse. And when one is an empress in reverse, they going through troubles at home. This might be um their relationships in jeopardy. This is an emotionally imbalanced woman. This woman may sometimes betray her friends. She's a bishop gossiper. She's a bishop backstabber. She love problems is a part of her life. It's a part of her persona. This is how she gained growth in that empress in reverse mode. What is another energy that these comics is out here in that they feel like they could be people wives but they over there living that project hood hood work that project chick hood rat chick like so the next energy that wanted to come out is strength in reverse yeah we know they ain't got the strength to live up to a divine feminine status because when one is in a strength in reverse they are tempted to abuse their power they are their worst enemy. They act like they strong and they got it together, but they fall to the park. They always minding somebody's energy and trying to control somebody else when they don't even have their own stuff together. What is the other energies, Holy Spirit? The other energy of today is the Seven of Cups energy. And when one is in a Seven of Cup energy, they are in a lack energy. They are not, they don't have the ability to stand on their own. They made possible bad decisions and they may can reconsider readjusting their moves. So, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we come to you today. We want to know why do these why is these comics out here living that life where they saying they they can be out here and be people wives. But they don't even have an apparatus to be somebody's girlfriend. We want to know, Holy Spirit, why is these comics out here want to be somebody's wife when they don't even have the apparatus to be somebody's girlfriend? Holy angels, please let us know. We would like to know why is these comments okay? Well, what is these? These want to be turned damn. These a lot of cards, it's a lot of cards turned over. What is that about? Okay, what 
These comments out here feel like they can take people energy and those things can okay well since they put those fell out. Yeah, these comments is out here in the energy we're gonna do. Um they saying cuz they see that because y'all divine feminists be out here, you know what I'm saying, showing that relaxed life. You know, y'all ain't doing a whole bunch of drama. Y'all ain't off the hook. So they out here shape-shifting. That's why they feel like they can live their wife life. Because they're able to shape-shift. Yes, they're able to show people fake love straight up to their face. They're able to show a person that they love them. That they fake fuck with them. And when they get what they want. Their representative go back to wherever they are. Yes, this is a person that's always in the energy where they bring in their representative. They don't never bring the real comic. The real comic, would you please stand up? They never stand up, baby. They always bring in their representative, that fake person, and then that real comic come out. Because this person is in the energy where they cannot communicate. This is the poor communication call. Yeah, they don't know how to communicate because all they know how to use is their lower extremities. Yes, this person, all they know how to use is their lower extremities. And they are in an energy where they're feeling alone, baby girl. They feeling like they is only in an energy where they can be a comic, darling. They want to reap the benefits of being somebody's wife. This is why they're guarded about divine masculine because they don't want him to leave and go nowhere, baby. If you got a lollipop, darling, you suck it. Yes, this is one that is sucking divine masculine's energy. This next card is energy warning. Please do not trust them. This is a person where she fuss and she fights and she puts divine masculine in the energy where he's constantly being police called and he's being in an instance where he's getting locked up. What is these other energies that this comic is constantly putting divine masculine in? We want to know. Why does she feel like she is merged material? That is the question. That is the $150,000 question that I want to know. Why does this person feel like they are merged material? They feel like they being merged material because they have chased divine masculine long enough. It's time for divine masculine to give in to them. Hmm. And our divine saying this chick is delusional. It is something going with her upstairs that ain't right, darling. It's the same shit, different day. This is why Divine Masculine don't want to be bothered with her. Divine Masculine don't want to be bothered with her because how she got him was her lustful vampire sexual draining ways. So Divine Masculine is in an energy where he don't want to be drained anymore by this comic. And that's a secret that he knows that the comic has his blood, his blood on her hands. And Divine Masculine is in an energy where he is keeping her distance from her. And she's in an energy where she's giving the evil eye. However, Divine Feminine is sitting over here watching saying, mm, I'm over here making me moves. But why I'm over here making me moves, I don't want to say I told you so. But I told you so. This next call is I predicted it. So Divine Feminine is in the energy where, yeah, you sat there and you put me in the energy where you fucked me over. Mm -hmm, that same shit that you did to me is going to come back to you. What else did you predict Divine Feminine that's going on with this masculine? Yes, what else did you say, girl? We want to know. What else was going on with you that you foreseen that you didn't say anything about? She said, yeah, I knew you was going to be in the energy where you was crying over me. Because you was always in the energy where that love was fake. Because that comic was over there using sex magic and all those things that she was using to get you. She 
She's saying, yeah, you was in the energy where you had, you was a prideful person, hmm. But what broke you down was the mind-altering spells from that comment that she was using when she was doing that magic. She's saying, yeah, you thought I was never going to get over your bullshit that you try to put me in what woman that want to be somebody's wife is always in an envious energy energy envious of another what what woman that want to be someone's wife that's always in an energy where haters is going to hate Divine Feminine said, real women don't try to get pregnant on purpose to have an old keep a nigga baby. Real women that's trying to be somebody's wife ain't always addicted to prescription pills. Real women that's trying to be somebody's wife ain't on no motherfucking stripper pole. We got respect for ourselves. We go out and get our own money. We play 50-50 in the household. We don't want a man to take care of us like Kami. We ain't out here hurting men like Kami. We ain't out here doing spells under the moonlight like Kami. We ain't out here being scorned that the lover is of the past lover is over there manifesting. What well, wife goes over there and still goes on online dating? Please let me know, says Divine Feminine. What else you want to know about this comment? Why she thinks she is a uh, uh, merged material and she not? Divine Feminine said those that want to be somebody's wife ain't always in a dysfunctional, addiction, drug-like energy. Those that want to be somebody's wife ain't showing their potential husband fake love straight up to their face. A potential wife ain't showing their friends, their fake friends, more attention than they show their supposedly fiancé. Real women don't do that. We give our men attention, baby girl. And real women don't go around there with that Jezebel spirit, so-called taking men as this common. I'm just saying, says Divine Feminine. Let her, let her know, Divine Feminine. What else real women don't do to get men? Divine Feminine. What else real women don't do to get men, says Divine Feminine. What else real women don't do? Mm. Mm. Real women don't be walking around simping. Real women ain't trying to get over on a man but the lying and the sneaking and the grinning. That's what real women don't do, Divine Feminine. Real women are stable like me. Real women ain't out here being energy vampires. Real women ain't out here being messy with a whole bunch of options. Real women ain't out here gaslighting, being confused about the, the moves that they make. Real women goes with their actions and make decisions, not all drugs, but are on sound mind. And when we make those sound mind decisions, we ain't guilt. Ding a ding, we ain't guilty about them. We ain't real women going through our men phone because we insecure about ourselves. We're not doing that. We're not going through mood swing issues because we have mental health concerns. Our man ain't telling us he's tired of us and our drama. This is the tide of drama call. Divine Feminine said, we ain't in the energy where we're doing bad motives on our mate. What are you today, Carmen? In the sheets or a hole on the floor? What is your title today? Everybody cautions from you because you always in an entanglement always in an affair, 
always in the energy where you want to have an old keeper, nigga, baby. Being the left alone, no one wants to deal with you because you always hacking, stalking in somebody's business because you insecure. Everybody knows what you call me. It's the same shit, different day. You have emotional problems. Something is wrong with you. Facts. You always looking up the ex-girlfriend because you jealous. Facts. People want your M F and head on a plaid. You the one that's involved in shady deals. How you gonna be somebody's wife being that way? What else is going on, Holy Spirit? All oh, these ones will be turned over. What else is going on, Holy Spirit? Yes. How you gonna be somebody where you always betraying someone and you in the energy of sorry, not sorry? Haters gonna hate, lovers gonna love. I don't even want none of the above. I know I inspire you. Yes, I do. I inspire you. I'm the field to the few. Yes, you wanna be me. Always in that energy where you sorry, not sorry. But you're always looking me up to see what's going on with my job. Always looking me up because you and your man always button heads and the police being cold. What else is going on in this situation of this comic? Yeah, baby. It's always domestic violence. They fussing and they fighting in front of those kids. It's a sinking ship relationship. How you gonna be someone's how you gonna be someone's wife when you can't even secure secure the bag of being in a relationship with someone common? How you gonna secure the bag of being somebody's wife when your ass is always drunk? How you going to secure the bag of somebody's wife when you can't even manage your money? This is the manage call. How you going to be somebody's wife when you can't even think for yourself because you always got your friend around in dynamic duo mode? Come. You are just like a damn Rubik's Cube. Every, the more you turn you, the harder you get. You just like a Rubik's Cube. The more you turn you, the harder you get. The harder you get with all these secrets, all these lies. This one got a whole lot of secrets that Divine Masculine is finding out. And one of them secrets is that uh, he been catfish. He been lied to. What else has he been, what has he been told that's not truthful about this karma? What is this? This one wanted to fall. She talks it. No one told this Divine Masculine that their comic was toxic. So again, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, we would like to know how do this comic feels like she is wifey material. She feel like she wifey material because her ass is crazy. She plumb damn crazy and this is what she thinks. Someone has been acting crazy or weird. This is why she thinks she um has she has the title. She can get the title of being wifey. She's aggressive. And she's always desperate. And I'm gonna leave you with that hoe is in denial. You're a project chick, you're a hood rat chick. Men don't really wanna wife those kind of females. And that you're, but you're in denial. I'm gonna say, if you like my vibe, like, share, and subscribe.